23 ABC's Matt Lively also joining us from downtown. He also has more on what was happening in those later hours tonight. Matt. Hey Jess, yeah, so now we're just a little bit away from the Bakersfield Police Department. And as you can see behind me, this scene has become clear. That wasn't the case. Once the protest started about three blocks the other direction around sunset, they moved right down here to the intersection of H Street and Truction. We have photos for you and video of that. As you can see, people down on their knees in front of the police line. SWAT was actually called in to help with that effort. And this stayed a largely very calm protest. Of course, we had the car much earlier that drove through protesters, but for the most part, this stayed an extremely calm protest. But right around here from about 8 p.m. to 10 p.m. off 8th Street in Trucks, and that's where the protest was happening. I spoke with a man who's been a Bakersfield resident for more than 30 years, and he had a powerful message about the protest tonight. This is supposed to be the greatest place on earth. Not for us. You know what I'm saying? It's not for us. The plan field ain't never been left ever, 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 ever been level. That was a lynching in modern day times. They broke that man's neck in front of millions of people. And that set off a chain reaction. They woke up the sleeping giant. And ain't no, hey, can't nothing come back from that. Sometimes you have to have war in order to have peace. Jess, it was right after 10 o'clock, just about 10.01 p.m. That is when SWAT and BPD started announcing that this had become an unlawful assembly and that arrest would be made if streets weren't cleared. And that's when we saw protesters finally moving out of the streets at just after 10, 10 p.m., about 10, 12. Three males were detained and brought into the Bakersfield Police Department. Those were the three protesters remaining in the middle of the street here at the intersection of H and Truxton. So that's the scene now things are clear from what I saw. It was three males that were detained by Bakersfield police and then brought into the station. But for now, a clear and calm scene. We're going to be with you for the remainder of our show coming in and out of this location. For now, though, I'm Matt Lively, 23 ABC News, connecting you.